This is Project 816, China's Cold War nuclear facility. Its mission was to make plutonium for an atomic bomb. Now tourists are getting a glimpse of the 20 kilometers of tunnels built by some 60,000 men like Chen Huaiwen, now in his 70s. Armed police kept watch outside while we worked on the construction. It was top secret. Entry was forbidden. At the time, ordinary people in the area only knew there was some project. They did not know what was being worked on. Construction began 50 years ago, as China tried to catch up with nuclear-armed Cold War rivals, the United States and the Soviet Union. For 17 years, the young soldiers worked day and night. For a country in that situation, you had to build those war preparation projects. Otherwise, big countries would bully you. Blasting through solid rock, many were sickened by toxic fumes and dust. Officially, 76 died. It was really tough back then. Life was tough, the environment was tough, and the construction work conditions were poor. It was quite dangerous. But by 1984, relations with the Soviet Union and US had improved, and China was opening up. Project 816 was deemed unnecessary and never completed. It was a colossal waste of resources. The costs of construction deep in the mountains and ravines were huge, but the benefits for society and the economy were extremely small. The site was declassified in 2002, but foreign visitors were only allowed in late 2016. And with only 10% of the area currently open, there could still be some more mysteries left to uncover.